Hey, what's up, everybody? Appreciate y'all again for coming over, taking the time out to view another video on my page. And today's special segment is going to be me talking about this new Karata MGL 70. Got it paired up with my uh, Denali Attack Rod 6'8. Um, for test purposes so I'm gonna do like a side on cast now straight throwing a um, weightless Cinco with a little power spin on the back um, for our hook just regular just testing it out just uh, got two brakes on Two brakes off. I mean, it casts. I mean, a light Cinco. Got it like nice little distance from the bank. The retrieve is is good. It's pretty amazing to be honest. And like I said, I'm just trying this reel out on different rods. Today I'm using the six foot eight Denali rod. And I'm just like side pitching it, you know, and it's slinging it out there, really no backlash. Nothing like that. Oh, I had a little bite. <laughs> Didn't expect that. I'm just doing a slow retrieve back. I barely can feel it moving. Slow retreat. The point of this video, man, I was trying to... Basically, in my opinion, I feel like this was designed for more of your finesse type applications with the lighter spool. So, I'm just kind of throwing real light um, lures. Really not fishing it, fishing it, you know, just messing around with it, getting comfortable with a lot of um, finesse techniques because uh, I actually use my spinning reel setups for a lot of, well, all of my finesse things, so something new. I like it a lot. Casting is great, man. I mean, just tossing a light, a weightless light Cinco, man, is it's pretty pretty good and I'm just like side on pitching it like right over by these bushes and I mean it's getting there every single time effortless you know no I haven't really um, I know I have not hooked a fish on this yet like I said I've just been tossing and tossing and you know messing around with different lures on it I think it's gonna do great um, I think I'll keep it with this and a couple spy baits and things like that but I mean like I'm getting right there over this overhang under these bushes man side on cast like basically pitching flipping whatever you technical anglers want to call it <laughs> Do it over, over the head cast. I mean, it's just getting it out there, man. And I'm not even putting a lot of force behind the cast. I'm just letting the the whole setup do its job, you know. I'm not no bass master pro anything I just feel like you know once you got the right setup when you got everything working together um, your fishing would be whatever that technique you are once you master you know all the settings and everything you know that nature 
you you good, man. You don't have to you don't have to overwork yourself, you know. Just match up match up everything the best you can. I don't know how well you guys can see this. It's real in action. Do another side on cast. I mean, no backlash, man, at all. She can I get a good retrieve? Some good retrieve footage for you. Smooth, man. Real smooth. Stops on the dime. Just a hard cast. Still don't backlash quick too bad. I just came back on the bank just to shoot this little quick segment. I'm letting it sink to the bottom. I'm gonna try to try to catch a fish this cast. Try to. Can't make any promises. I mean, I don't even know if you guys can hear the the smoothness through my um, my camera or the retrieve on this thing, man. And like the casting, like you can't even really, you just, phew, you know. Sink a sink a little bit. Got a little bit right there, just a little bit. It ain't much. It won't much. Got us a little ding. Ah, oh. <laughs> oh man, little ding got me, man. Got me, man. Oh, let's see here. Got me. But guys, that's um my new Corrado. MGL 70 throwing a weightless Cinco. Um, I'm very satisfied. It's pretty amazing. Nice reel for the money. So if it's anybody interested, um, follow me on my Instagram and was waiting for this video and you needed some clarification or or anything about this reel. It's a go. It's a go, man. It's worth it. Um, like I said, only through light, finesse, 
stuff on it. Um, I'm definitely gonna. I mean, it got it's design. It has the power to handle big fish, and I'm sure it has the power to you know get down on some heavier lures. I'm sure. Um, moving forward, I definitely, definitely will be changing it up, putting this thing through the ringer. Um, definitely in the market already for at least at least one more. Uh, definitely got one more uh, in mind. Probably go ahead and get that ASAP, man. I, I really like it. Um, I never really been the small real guy, to be honest. This is my second one. I do have the SLX MGL. It's pretty sweet too, but this bad boy right here is like the the Tesla, the water to me, man, for the the Shimano bait casters. This is my personal opinion. Don't nobody try to tear me up in the um, in the comment section down below. Um, this I know this little thing gonna be a workhorse for me, and I'm ready to um, hook up on some fish with it. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, like I said, leave me some comments below, uh, likes, and if you haven't subscribed to my channel. You already know what to do. So, go ahead and end it here, guys. I'm going to cast a little bit more, man. Hopefully, I can catch a uh, few more fish before the, uh, the sun go down. Um, so, I give this a 10, man, in my book, man. Scale 1 to 10, it's a 10. Bad little joker. Don't sleep on it. Um, check out, you know...